am Betty and this is another episode of The Finance Day. Over the past few weeks on The Finance Day, we have been looking at issues pertaining to couples and marriages. But today we want to um, focus on an issue that comes before marriage. We want to focus on courtship. Um, we want to find out how long should the courtship last. Some people believe it should last two weeks. Some people think three months. Some people think five years. So we want to go into the streets to find out people's opinions on the length of a, con- of a courtship. Should last. Oh, to marriage, I guess. To marriage, like how long? Give a number. Maybe like two years. Mm, probably like six months. But it should not be more than within a year or two. You might need someone for a year, but the person, and at the end of the day, it leads to marriage. A year, a year max. The minimum, or the maximum, that is just. One year, two years. Let me say two years is okay for me. Um, dating is just. I think it's just a. <laughs> a child play. It's just a state of indecisiveness. It's just hanging out, like with opposite sex. You are both of you are still on. Uh, you just agree that you want to observe each other for a while. Courtship is. It has to do with something serious, like maybe this is guy I hope to marry one day. Okay. You just take her, like you 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 propose to her. After proposing to her, she says yes. What happens between that time she says yes and the time you are marrying is courtship. Courtship is a period of preparing yourselves for living together. But when you are talking about courtship, everybody knows. But in dating, everybody, you are just still on observation. Let me observe you, let me observe you. So when you now sit down again and agree that, okay, I want to marry you, then you now proceed by showing it to your parents to your friends anything uh, anything more than a year is is unnecessary things we enter you know you start seeing each other's faults she's not so i think she's finer than this so she's not even finer than this i think she can cook so she cannot cook so unnecessary things start to crop in when it's more than a year because she normally get boring at times if it's too long it's boring you just be like ah, why am i in this relationship going why because it's too long most of you are, but if it is two years, you want to go, eh, go, go and go to your marriage, just settle down. Now, dating is quite strange uh, because what it means to some people is an opportunity to get to familiarize with one another while there's no commitment. The, the, the ultimate reason for every kind of close relationship between a man and a woman should culminate in marriage. So while you are dating, and you are dating many people, I think in a way, you, that's a measure of commitment already. For that reason, I will say that you don't date more than one person at a time. Uh, for you to, in good conscience, approach God and ask for his counsel on what you want to do, it is best that you make sure that it's only one person at a time. Uh, many times we allow ourselves to have fallen into a union, into a relationship. We're already in love with the person before we begin to ask that, uh, what does God think? In which case, your asking is not in good conscience because you're already interested in the person anyway. And what God says might not really be what you eventually end up doing because you already have at the back of your mind what you want to do. You're already in love. So if you ask me, dating should be to one person at a time and during that one time you make sure that you keep a good conscience in your relationship and do not make it more than two or three outings before you eventually make up your mind as to whether you want to go into courtship. Talking about the length of courtship, I would suggest that um, courtship must not be too long, neither must it be too short. I believe, and this is just a suggestion, you do not find scriptures for it. Courtship should not be shorter than six months. Six months during which, of course, you are all eyes. <laughs> this is the person I'm going to spend the rest of my life with. So six months, for those who are kind of in a hurry because they've waited so long, but maximum of one year also. And that's the final say. Don't forget to subscribe and share video. Until next time, I'm Betty.